Hog Ball came to a close in Super Regionals, but Arkansas' season had a super impact on its young fans all over the state. Go Hogs! Like kids catching the Trabs over at Dickey Stevens Park. Watching the Razorbacks this year grew their love for baseball and inspired them to improve their own game. So like I play baseball, they practice a lot and I do too. So I feel like I can be as good as them if I, if I practice like them. I believe in myself and I know that I'm as good as them when I grow up. They've had good hitters, really good hitters, and they've had uh, good pitchers. I feel like I can do it because they're just, they were or, they're just ordinary people. Probably their dream was to get there, and so is my little brother. So that points out that you can maybe achieve a lot. All the players, how fast they were, and I've been trying challenging myself to be that fast and hit that good, as the Razorbacks do. My name's Maddox, and I was named after Greg Maddox. So it's always been my dream to just kind of pitch like Kevin Copps and Greg Maddox. It definitely was exciting to watch Kevin Copps pitch. Well, I actually play tournament baseball, so I admire his pitching style. I try to work up to like his pitching speed and learn all of his pitches. Be it a child or an adult, you can't deny that the Razorbacks represented the state with style. I've been born here my whole life and I guess 41 years, so Arkansas is the hometown for me and Arkansas is the good team. and. I've been up there for Special Olympics in Fayetteville. They get a lot of faith in them and do everything they can and keep going. Don't quit. Don't give up. This is the only time I noticed it was on TV. I liked watching the tournament. They represent our state. The top-ranked Razorbacks encourage local kids that they too can be on that national stage one day. Especially serving as an example are homegrown Arkansas natives. Take Caden Wallace of Greenbrier, for example. The players were just so amazing, making amazing plays, especially Caden Wallace, because I'm from Greenbrier too. And like, the Razorbacks are in the SCC, which is hard, and like, Greenbrier is not very known. Caden Wallace, he's from Greenbrier, and that's where I'm from. He could possibly get to the major leagues and possibly point Greenbrier out to the world. I think that'd be cool. Caden Wallace is from Greenbrier, and I'm from Greenbrier. He's one of my favorite players on the Razorbacks. The Hogs never dropped an SEC series, won the conference tournament, and captured the attention of the nation. And they captured the imaginations of Arkansas kids. I mean, they were first in the nation. I was a little sad that they lost against North Carolina. I thought they were going to make it, but I liked watching their offense and just watching them hit. It was just fun. To be honest, they're hitting keep their hands right, and if you lose your hands, then you're just going to make a foul ball. Somehow they just keep their hands steady on it. It was very fun and exciting. It was a lot of fun watching them win those big games and very close games. It was sad when, they, when we lost, but they had a really good year. They didn't quit no matter what, even if they got hurt. Well, they were so good, they were talented, it was a couple hard teams, it was really education. They're good and they're the best team. They hustle and they try their best. Probably that the filming's so great and so is the hitting. Casey Opitz because he's their catcher, like I'd say their best player, important player, toughest player. The Razorbacks led the country in home runs, and nothing makes these kids cheer like a moonshot does. Dumb just hit so many home runs. Most of the home runs hit a lot of homers. Well, their home run cycle, that was awesome. The next day I hit one, but they are all inside the park home runs. And don't forget about the play on the bump. I remember about the fast pitchings, because the fast pitchings are my favorite. Kevin Copps broke out this year, becoming a Golden Spikes front runner and what many consider to be the best player to ever go through the program. Kids loved watching him play just as much as adults did. If you had to have a signed baseball by somebody, who would that be from? That would be from Kevin Copps. He is one of the uh, greatest college series baseball pitchers ever. And he is one of my favorite uh, Razorbacks players ever. He was a very good pitcher and I think he got us a long way. Nick Walters, Fox 16.